Hello again, our YouTube fans. This is the real creepy dummy here. I'm back with an all new episode. It is November the 25th of 2022. Time is now 12.42 a.m. Okay, the real creepy doll man made a promise to bring not one but two unreleased bonus episodes to you for this Black Friday. The day after Thanksgiving. This is the after Thanksgiving special from the real creepy doll man. Um, the real creepy doll man decided to do them as a double episode and do them separately. So I'm going to do them today. Before we kick off the first one, I'm going to let you know that these episodes are going to be very disturbing and there may be controversy at the end of these videos. If parent, if the adult, my mistake, if the adult parents have something to say about it. Let, let's go back to the issue. The real creepy doll man wanted to release these videos, whether the parents like it or not, and whether the adults like it or not. Uh, now, it doesn't make the real creepy doll man the villain here, but will it make these two, what I say in the video, these two spirits that I talk about the villain? That'd be you decide. Before we kick it off, let's go back. The real creepy doll man wanted to look for lost footage like he said he was going to do. I looked up my old LG phone that I had that had footage off that phone that I saved that I have recorded and saved and I had saved a lot of them videos from the past and doing so I looked at every inch of every video I had more than probably about 20 videos or more but probably my guess about 20 or 30 videos or maybe a little over 20 or 30 videos I could not conclude to find one video of that video. It is possible the real creepy doll man had made ordered the real creepy ghost hunter junior to erase that video. I do remember what these two spirits have say and gave me their names and what they have done, but I do not remember their age or their race. So I will bring up what they have done and their names as we go along with this. But I can tell you, I would say this to be precaution to all the adult parents. If you allow your children to watch this episode or not, there will be in a full description a parent advisory that I'm going to be issuing right now at before the end of this video. Now, before we begin, I didn't really want to release this video. I decided to keep it secretly from the public, meaning not just from the public, from the YouTube fans, the Die Hard Real Creepy Doll Man fans. I also kept it secretly from my family, my friends, my neighbors. I kept it secretly from my people, from the people I go to church to. I kept it secret from also for the people I knew, uh, anybody I knew personally. The only two people knew that this video exists was both me and the real creepy ghost hunter junior we have kept silent on this video for so long i personally the real creepy doll man could not keep silent no more of this videos i had to allow these two to be leaked and i had to allow them to be released out of the closet because it's time it's time to get it cleared out of the way allow them to be told allow this thing to be over with they should have been told a long time ago and been told probably first a long time ago. Now the real creepy doll man's going to tell them today. Now, we're going to do it like this. It's going to be said like this when we begin. We'll kick it off to say it like this. Michael, the possessed doll, unreleased bonus episode is what it will be called. And in doing so, it also be say like this. In our communications and in our investigations with both me and the real creepy ghost hunter junior, we found the name of the male spirit that is attached to this twenty-three, yeah, twenty-three inch female vinyl doll. His name is Michael. Now Michael didn't give us a last name. So last name will be unknown at this very time. Michael gave us very little detail how he lived his life just before he died. But sad to say Michael didn't give us a description of what race he is. 
So race will be unknown at this very time. Now Michael also, plus Michael didn't give us one other thing. Michael didn't give us his age. So age will be unknown at this very time as well. Sad to say Michael didn't give us the month, day, or year when he died. So all that will be unknown as well. As we interview Michael off record, and I believe this was done on Communicating with Our Spirit Friends, what episode, we do not know. Uh, we interview Michael throughout the video. Uh, I don't remember what we said that he said, what his age and what his race was. So that will be unknown for this time. Plus, we did find out one thing. Both me and the real creepy ghost hunter Jr. found out. That Michael had a little secret. That Michael was a child molester. What children did he molest? We do not know. Was it male or female? Meaning young boys or young girls? We do not know. But in doing this act and this courageous crime, was he ever convicted? We also do not know. So all that will remain a mystery at this very time. But was Michael ever convicted for this crime? We do not know. And how did he die? We also do not know. So everything will remain a mystery and be unknown at this very time. Well, the real creepy doll man did have some theories, but I think it's best we pass on the theories. So I'm going to leave a parent advisory on this episode to all parents. If you have small children that wants to watch this episode, they must get their parents' permission first. Due to the graphic nature of uh, child molesting and sexual theme and adult content of I guess 14 I would rate it this is the real creepy dog man saying all the fans out there keep watching more to come we have one more unreleased bonus episode to kick off our last one for Black Friday who will it be watch and find out and this is the real creepy dog man saying all the fans out there goodbye and God bless you all.